Disclaimer. The contents of this video is not meant to treat, diagnose or cure any disease or illness. It is for information purposes only. Make sure you watch all the way to the end to also learn about some of the potential health risks associated with a ketogenic diet. 3 Benefits of a Ketogenic Diet Number 3 An Alternative Treatment for Epilepsy The ketogenic diet, used since the 1920s as a treatment for epilepsy. Evidence shows it to be a good alternative for patients that may have issues with the standard surgical and pharmaceutical treatments of epilepsy. We have a wealth of information going back 100 years now, which indicates the benefits of a low-carb ketogenic diet on epilepsy. It is thought that this diet could possibly be beneficial in mental health issues, like autism, bipolar disorder, psychosis, Alzheimer's disease, and maybe more. People often report experiences of mood stabilization on a ketogenic diet. Number 2. Improved control of type 2 diabetes. In regards to diabetes, the ketogenic diet is said to be an effective alternative that relies less on medication. There is evidence that reducing carbohydrate intake lowers body weight and, in patients with type 2 diabetes, improves glucose control. Despite the evidence, appropriateness of reducing carbohydrate intake in obese patients and in patients with diabetes is still debated. The benefits of a ketogenic diet for epilepsy have been known for a long time, but things like weight loss and reversal control of type 2 diabetes have been more recently discovered. This means there is less data, and so sustainability, safety, and efficacy for diabetes in the long term are still in debate. Number 1. Weight loss. Studies have shown weight loss advantages of a ketogenic diet when compared to the previously recommended standard low-fat diet alternatives. Also shown to be potentially able to decrease fat mass and visceral adipose tissue without decreasing lean body mass. It is proven to be very effective for rapid weight loss, but researchers still question its sustainability, long-term effectiveness, and potential associated health risks. Studies show that the weight loss benefits of a low-carb diet seem to peak at about 5 months.
studies also showed that at 6 to 24 months, that a ketogenic diet group lost 2.2 kilograms more than a low-fat diet group, however the results were inconsistent. Despite long-term inconsistencies, evidence indicates that the ketogenic diet can produce dramatic improvements to weight loss in the short term. Bonus benefit Increased focus and mental clarity It has been shown by many research groups that a ketogenic diet can exert a strong neuroprotective effect relative to social behavior and cognition. Newer studies seem to be further confirming that cutting cards could improve cognition and memory. The key to a ketogenic diet is to be in a metabolic state known as ketosis. This usually can be done by limiting the intake of carbohydrates. The ketogenic diet, in its simplest terms is a high-fat, medium-protein, and low-carbohydrate diet. It can however get much more complex depending on your approach. There are other potential benefits which we haven't covered, for things like autoimmune diseases, cancer, heart disease, and more. Some benefits may still be in debate, and some others are controversial, inconsistent, and difficult to navigate. So we may save these and cover them in the future. Please check the description for useful links, credits, references and other information sources. Thanks for watching. Please spare just a few more minutes for some important information. Warning. Here are just some of the potential effects and risks that have been associated with, but are not limited to a ketogenic diet. Also be aware that any extreme form of dieting can evoke eating disorders in some people. Some effects of a ketogenic diet include a collection of symptoms like Nausea, vomiting Headache, fatigue, dizziness, insomnia, difficulty in exercise tolerance And constipation sometimes referred to as keto flu. These symptoms usually resolve in a few days or sometimes a few weeks. People who have existing issues should seek advice from a doctor, and possibly a dietitian, before attempting this diet. In people with diabetes there is a risk of severe hypoglycemia if their medication is not adjusted to suit. Possible long-term adverse effects include hepatic stetosis, hypoproteinemia, kidney stones, vitamin and mineral deficiencies. Although people on this diet show dramatic improvements in the short term, it is said that this diet can increase morbidity and mortality in the long run. Key 
keeping these and other possible risks and concerns in mind, it is up to you to decide if the potential benefits outweigh the potential risks. Lastly, to end on a positive, there is an article that states Despite its high fat component, studies have shown the ketogenic diet to be safe and even beneficial for cardiometabolic risk factors. It has been in continuous use for almost a century for the treatment of epilepsy and has shown good tolerability, even in children. Current ketogenic diet protocols involve a range of options, which encourages patient compliance. A link to this article can be found in the description. Thanks again for watching. If you found any of this information useful, please consider subscribing.